Hey, what's going on guys? So today we're here inside of Colin Wall Fine Arts and we're gonna be taking some bridal portraits. Now, over the years, I've had the pleasure of working here a number of times and I've actually even created some images here that have won me some awards. But the location is filled with a lot of jewels for us to be able to use for scenes, like this staircase area that we have right now. And then there's a couple rooms downstairs where we'll actually go in and capture some portraits natural light, mix a little bit of natural light with flash as well, and we'll see what we get. So to start the day, I'm starting off with my Canon R5 with the 28 to 70 2.0. You know this is my go-to lens, this is my workhorse right now. Now let's get into it and see what we get. All right, so today we're working with our beautiful model, Jazlyn, and we're actually gonna start off against the stained glass window here inside of the venue. We're using it as our main source of light, and if you know me, you know I love directional light, so my main focus is to use it and create some sort of Rembrandt light on my model. So just because I know everybody's gonna ask, my current settings are shutter speed 200, f2.0 for my 28 to 70, and 100 ISO. Slightly turn the chin towards the window. Right, right. Perfect. Slightly turn your body right there. Right, but just give me the chin. Right, there we go. Stay right there. Bring the hands down a little bit. There we go. Soften that hand just a little bit. Right, there we go. Perfect. that hand, we're gonna use that as part of the motion in this shot, okay? Same yep. Right. And let's like, let's like utilize the veil. So pull the, pull the veil over the shoulder. Right. And actually from there, take that right hand and grab the tip of the hair. Right, yeah, right, there we go. Right there. Chin up a little. Oh, that's it right there, and I wasn't ready. One more time, do it. Be sure you get that chin, that chin a little higher. Oh, there it is, that's perfect. So I don't want, I don't want you like this, right? I want you more like this. All right, so thus far I've been using the 28 to 70 for the majority of the shoot, but now I'm actually gonna switch over to a super wide angle so that I can get a shot at the staircase, Jazlyn in front, and we're gonna do some silhouette. We're just gonna figure out how to get a big epic shot. And actually do me a favor, so pull that, pull the hair off to the side so it doesn't go under the chin. All right, so real quick, I'm actually gonna be doing a shot from the top of the stairs, but as she starts to turn the corner, I won't have a lot of light in her face since she'll be slightly backlit. So I'm actually bringing this light into play. This is my Westcott FJ200 with a Magbox 24 on it. And I'm actually just gonna turn it towards, you know, her face where she is on the stairs and fire it off to give me a little bit of light in her face once she starts to get backlit. All right, so now we're in place. Jasmine's in place and I have my light down here to my right. Now we're gonna test the settings to be sure that we get the shot that we want. Bring your chin down a little right there. All right, guys, that wraps it up for this video. So we were able to get some really great portraits of Jazlyn. I'm really excited about the stuff that we captured. And hopefully it gave you some ideas of how you can maneuver on wedding day to be able to capture some great photos of your bride. 